Hi there, Cosmic Family. My name is Jess Leal in this incarnation. So today, um, well, this is the first day of the 2023. Uh, I hope you are okay today. Um, I, I want to talk about the ascension process. Um, in the channels, in, in the other YouTube channels that I have, I, uh, I, I talked about it uh, in many ways, many perspectives. Uh, but uh, I wanted to start the year by saying uh, this in all the channels um, because I think it's very important and because I saw um, a lot of information, a lot of information uh, um, and many of those messages are uh, contradictions. Um, so... What I have to say, of course, is it's my truth. Uh, it doesn't have to be uh, yours. But um, I highly recommend to hear everything with um, our mind connected to our heart. Uh, everything, <laughs> every chakra connected to our heart. Um, because uh, I don't know if somebody tells me tells me that um, they are uh, channeling uh, Jesus, um, Metatron, uh, or the the Earth itself. Um, it doesn't say anything. It doesn't say anything to me. Um, it doesn't mean anything. Um, I only uh, hear the things with my heart, and I um, connect with that. If I resound with something then I take it but um, that's the only way um, I don't believe in anything but uh, my intuition right now and I think that this is the way uh, it's going to be for everyone uh, because there's so much uh, information and it is going to to cause a lot of confusion uh, I think um, many forces, I, I already told you that uh, dark forces are here just to uh, push push us to uh, evolve, but um, they are producing, they are causing this confusion just to uh, get us distracted. Um, so I already talked to you about uh, Parravicini, uh, this man who was born in Argentina. I am going to leave the, that video in the first comment, the first first fixed comment and um, I am talking about him because um, I didn't um, upload that video uh, in this channel uh, yet but I will um, but in my, my Spanish channel I, I, I uploaded a, a video talking about transhumanism uh, because Parravicini um, had many psychographies talking about that and uh, I I told in that in that video I had a dream because uh, my main communication with my guides uh, it, it is through dreams and through my um, my own mind you know I, I'm channeling my own uh, messages uh, I even I um, almost don't hear anybody there's one channeler uh, from Spain that I I like to uh, hear uh, hear her sometimes but uh, I, I I don't uh, hear another channelers anymore and um, well this dream uh, it's uh, totally um, aligned with uh, the Parravicini messages and I'm seeing this because this man uh, was um, like in a, in, a, in a part of his mission, he, he was very resistant to keep going with that, but he had no choice. He was like obligated. And I think um, that happened because uh, his mission was really very important to uh, all the, the messages they leave, they left, um, he left, sorry, um, are very important for us to hear just to resound you know nobody is guiding us uh we we can't find the guide outside the guide it's inside every time we have to remember this again and again and again because um 
many of these darkness forces um, are operating uh, in leaders that are very charismatic, that are very psychopathic, <laughs> and uh, they are distracting people uh, from doing their their labor. You know. Uh, so I I never I'm not going gonna to give names ever. Uh, I'm not doing that. I don't believe in that. But I do believe in um, how and in, in instruct like uh, uh, other people instructed myself uh, in recognize this kind of people and and to know when we are operating with uh, spiritually cults <laughs> or uh, leaders that are narcissistic or psychopathic. Um, so I am getting this clear, uh, this, this, this thing about the Ascension, because I'm going to express what I think uh, the Ascension is and, and that's all, <laughs> that's all I, I'm going to do. I'm going to do, um, so first thing, um, I already, uh, told you in the, in the Paravicini video, but, um, these uh, uh, interdimensional people, races, uh, or it is whatever you, you want to call them, um, that I, I am connected with them. Uh, I think I, I told you this in the first video. I am not um, like um, always telling this in every video because I don't think I am special about this. I think everyone has this connection, but. Uh, in the last year, um, many technologies have um, activated, and that's all. Uh, there is no uh, special people here. Uh, I don't believe in that either. <laughs> so, um, well, uh, I think these um, these friends, <laughs> these uh, brothers uh, of other dimensions, they are participating um, in this process, of course. But uh, I saw in many videos that uh, many people are telling that and they are going to uh, rescue us and, and um, taking us to another planet. I don't believe that because uh, these uh, psychographies that Parravicini did uh, that were uh, more than 1,400 psychographies, a lot of, um, I think they did uh, that for something, you know, and uh, many people uh, in Argentina, uh, many people uh, told that he was doing that because he wanted to gain something, but he had no gain by doing that. It was um, uh, on the contrary, because uh, many people criticized him. He was totally uncomprehended at that time, because uh, in in 1970, uh, here people was very, um, I don't know if the word, the word is retrograde, but, um, well, uh, they, they didn't understand about these things. And uh, they didn't um, uh, were open to to understand these things, um, and he uh, suffered a lot because of this. Because he was uh, someone that was very uncomprehended, uh, like a lot of people that uh, incarnated here uh, and and have messages to give and had. Um, so I think this guy. Uh, had nothing, nothing, nothing to gain uh, in doing all that. Uh, he dedicated he, he, his entire life to doing this. So I think it was very, very honest about um, all the things he channeled because many, cha many, many messages, he didn't even know what, uh, what uh, he was um, drawing, you know? But, um, well... Uh, I, I will talk about him later in other videos explaining other other things. Uh, so I resound, I resonate a lot with um, his message because uh, I uh, got the same messages uh, in my dreams uh, since I was a kid. Uh, I, I had a lot of um, dreams about the future and many people uh, had have this gift. Actually, everybody have this gift. But there's people who has uh, a more um, uh, has this like more developed. 
but everybody can do it, do this. It's not, uh, it's n n nothing that we can do, uh, even mediums, even uh, channelers or um, people who heal with um, their hands or everything, everything is something that everyone can do. There's no special people. Uh, there, they are only people who developed it more easily, maybe, uh, or uh, in a fluid way. But that's all. So, um, okay, I think the ascension. So uh, it, it has to be. Um, it is connected with this. Uh, this it is. Um, I I told you that. Um, uh, a celestial uh, uh, core a planet uh, is going to fall in the Antilles um, in that video. So uh, the uh, Central America and 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 from Central America to North America, it, it it's the um, the part which uh, is going to have more chaos. But we don't have to worry about this. Uh, I told this about uh, I told this in the video of facing the system collapse because all we have to focus on is our evolution. It's our labor. It's our job. <laughs> in it's our inner work. It's the only thing we have to worry about. To be worried about, because um, it doesn't care if we are in in. I am. I, I told you that I'm in Buenos Aires, and this city is going is going to sink, uh, like the entire city. Uh, but I, I don't. I am not worried about that, because um, I know that I will move uh, when 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 I need to. So the important part is to be. Is, it is to be um, peaceful. Is to feel peace in every step we are making we're giving um the the main thing here is to hear the inner voice if we um for example it's not okay if i am feeling that i have to move from the city and i am i am uh pretending that i'm not hearing that inner voice that's different but if i am okay if i if, if i know that i'm doing a process here in the city or whatever, in whatever place um, we we are, um, it's okay. It's okay because I think uh, our brothers, uh, our ET brothers, our dimensional brothers will help in this transition. And um, many people is saying that they are gonna rescue in um, in ovnis uh, in in. Uh, in uh, the word that, that is coming to me you now is plain, but uh, in ships, in ships, um, but they are gonna rescue people uh, who are in the vibration, and um, they are gonna take them in to to safety uh, lands. I don't think we are going to uh, a, another planet. I think the ascension it's in our body and it's in this planet and that is the the special thing that is why uh, many races may, many many dim dimensional races are um putting the attention in this process of us and not all of them are uh, uh, you know people from light <laughs> but uh there is no wrong or right you know again darkness that forces are helping us to evolve so um the most important thing it's it is our labor and that we uh we don't focus in in in, in save ourselves just to uh choose ourselves and again uh, uh, sorry now i'm going to uh get clear about this because I heard in other videos that uh, there are uh, the chosen ones that uh, they are gonna be uh, saved in this process, and um, that uh, it's um, there's no much time left. You know, uh, I think yeah, um, 
the the events are closer I, are, are close but uh, there are no chosen ones <laughs> the chosen ones are the people who are choosing themselves and you choose yourself by doing your labor by hearing your inner voice by uh, um, acting um, hearing your intuition and uh, hearing your heart so if you are doing all of that uh, you are choosing yourself if you really want to do this transition you're going to do it I, I think um, every every person that is that is putting our uh, that is putting their their energy in do their inner work um, has uh, opportunity uh, nobody uh, has the ascension bot <laughs> Uh, I think this is very um, like um, I don't know and a, a hopeful a message to give. You know, uh, many people can um, could could be right now like uh, I, I'm I I I know I don't like the the word awakening because I I think we are always awakening <laughs> until we are we uh, come back to the found, uh, but. Uh, uh, many people is changing their perception and they are starting now and maybe those kind of messages uh, just give the sense that uh, they, they won't do it and I myself years ago I I, I once uh, questioned this to me uh, uh, because I, I wasn't feeling okay you know I was in a low vibration and and I said, okay, I, I don't know if I could do this, if I, I could do the planetary transition. And um, and that's a, a, a question that uh, doesn't serve anybody. Um, we don't have to focus there. It's uh, It doesn't care, really, if um, we can do it or no. The main focus is the here and now and to um, connect with love. This is this is the the the, the main um, labor, you know. Um, I didn't talk about this in this channel either, but I am going to explain um, the process of death, um, because th this is a evolution system. Uh, so I don't believe in death. Uh, I, I believe this is a, a, a transformation process. Of course, it, it is painful to uh, lose a people we love, but we don't have to worry about that. Um, and and if, we, if we are in that place right now, you know, uh, mm, we have to deal with that pain. I don't think ascension has to be with feeling okay all the time. That's totally ridiculous, and it's like denying our own humanity. Um... Uh, I, I don't think uh, that's the path for ascension, <laughs> to feel okay all the time at all. Um, so what we only have to do is to focus in uh, reconnect to our, ourselves when um, sometimes we, we get lost. But if we get lost, we are getting lost just to find ourselves again. Uh, just keep going. Don't don't anybody uh, let you believe uh, I don't know that you don't deserve to ascend. You know, uh, <laughs> it's a it's an it's a decision actually. Um, it's a, a decision uh, of of an inner decision. <clears throat> so I I don't uh, resonate with uh, that that kind of messages that there are chosen ones. Uh, and what's more, uh, well, this, this thing about, uh, if we are going to stay in this planet or we are going to another planet, actually it's not important either, but I'm saying this because, uh, I think Paravicini who described this, this process, um, uh, who described the, the entire process, even what happened next after, um, uh, all, all the cataclysm happened. Um, and they describe that we are going to share with uh, the dimensional brothers and uh, we're going to share like a culture music and, and we're go going to be part of that. Uh, we're not going to be 
a planet that thinks they are um, humans on their own and there's nothing that exists outside. So um, I, I really, really resonate with that part. Uh, but again, uh, this uh, hasn't, hasn't to be um, your truth. Um, but I think the, the most important part is, is this one of the labor because I heard messages about uh, that we don't have to do anything because the planet is going to elevate so uh, we're going to elevate with the planet and we don't have to do anything that's totally uh, I was going to uh, say that about a word uh, that, that it, that's no okay that's not okay <laughs> I don't resound with that uh, at all. Uh, we do have to um, do a job, a work. Uh, we do have we do uh, have to put um, energy in that. It's not easy, of course. It, it is not. I I myself have a lot of days uh, that are difficult, and everybody uh, has it. Um, but. Uh, that doesn't mean that uh, I have to sit in on my chair and wait for the ascension and doing by doing nothing. Uh, I think that kind of messages are the ones that are there to distract people, and they are danger dangerous really. Uh, they they com they they are there to confuse. So don't believe anything. <laughs> Just put in practice on your own life and see what uh, what serves, serves you and um, what things really uh, gives you the truth, you know, you feel the truth inside and nobody, nobody will give, will give you that. So um, uh, this channel thing, I, I, I really um, appreciate people who, who really can do that job and um, you know, put their ego aside to uh, really uh, give a message from from love. But uh, not all the people can do it, and I don't believe in every channeling um, writing that I that I hear, that I see, or that I hear. So this is very important. Um, so. Uh, the main focus is the labor, and this is uh, why and it's not only because uh, we're going to stay after all the changes, uh, but also because uh, we we we're going to be able to transcend uh, like um, situations that are strong too. You know, uh, that are very. Um, you know, I, it's not. I think it's not easy to to see. Uh, uh, that kind of change in, in, in the planet, you know, the cataclysm. And uh, we have to be like um, uh, in, a, in a strong, uh, in, a, in a strong mood in, in our minds, you know. Uh, but I think this process will guide us, uh, that's what I, I received, will guide us to feel that way uh, when that event uh, comes. So we don't have to worry about anything, just to not ignore our inner voice. Not ignore our inner voice. It's only we, what we have to do. And then just um, keep going, keep going, and, 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 and accepting everything we are feeling, if we are feeling pain, if we are feeling sadness, uh, anger, whatever. Uh, we are not here uh, to deny our human um, part, we are here to, to connect to love, to learn to connect to love. And that's not easy for us. Uh, we've been in centuries um, <laughs> practicing uh, distortion, you know, our society. So uh, we are the, the ones that are going to change that in, and it's not easy. So okay, people, I just want to get clear about this um thank you everyone and um see you in next videos ciao ciao